And now the 22 News Storm Team forecast. Let's take a look at our Springfield live camera 713 this morning. We're getting a bit of wet weather to start off our Sunday and our St. Patrick's Day. But this wet weather should subside as we go into the afternoon, just in time for the Holyoke St. Patrick's Parade. Greenfield Live camera, it's not going to be as wet in Greenfield, but still getting some sprinkles and scattered showers here too. You can see the roads are a bit slick this morning, so make sure if you are on your way to your St. Patrick's festivities, one, that you're going to be safe, and two, that you aren't driving too fast on the roads. Our 22 New Storm Team forecast focus showing us today, St. Patrick's Day, having a wet a.m., but we're drying in the p.m., not going to be seeing as many if any of those scattered showers and this first day of the week monday breezy cool the main thing dry as we get closer to spring we're not trying to see much more of that wet weather that we saw a lot of this winter but next week on and off wet weather is going to be a factor some days we are going to have some sprinkles and we might even see some more snow in the forecast later this week 22 new storm team esp live doppler radar showing us we are getting those scattered showers but we're getting a bit of a break as we see this is going to start pushing east and we'll have a better view of it on our clouds and radar we can see that that little break is pushing east so we will be seeing that break across the Connecticut River Valley, but then more showers are to come after that. But not much is behind the wet weather we're seeing now, giving us a clearer outlook going into the later morning. Temperatures now mainly in the low to mid 40s, 45 in Agawam, 44 in South Hadley, 42 in Palmer and Wendell. Berkshire County seeing some cooler temperatures in Lanesboro, 39, 43 in Stockbridge. And our 22 News Storm Team Skycast showing us that we're getting those scattered showers now at 7 a.m. As we go on through the morning, we'll see that very quickly those are going to taper off and become way more isolated showers as we can see closer to 11 a.m. And then going into the afternoon and the early evening, 6 p.m. this evening, not not expecting that wet weather to stick around, but we can still expect some cloud cover this evening. Partly cloudy skies are definitely going to take over around 12 a.m. Monday morning. We can definitely expect that, but not again, not seeing much of that wet weather as Monday is going to be a dry day. 6 a.m. Monday morning, no clouds in the Connecticut River Valley, and that's going to go for the rest of Western Massachusetts close to about noontime tomorrow. But we do see that increasing in cloud cover as we go into the evening. 5 p.m. Monday evening, we do see a bit of an increase in cloud cover than the earlier daylight hours, and that cloud cover is going to stick around through 12 a.m. Tuesday morning. Now, Tuesday is going to be a nice day as well. I'm not expecting too much in terms of wet weather, but definitely a sprinkle, not around 12 p.m. 12 p.m. Tuesday is going to be nice, but we can possibly see a sprinkle going into the overnight on Tuesday. As for today, we are going to have some AM scattered showers and those breezy conditions. We are seeing a little bit higher wind gusts. 26 miles an hour is what's expected today. 56 to 60 is our range of highs and our low temperatures are starting to drop as we're experiencing a cooling trend. Partly cloudy skies tonight. 28 to 34 is our range of lows and our 22 new storm team seven day forecast showing us that on and off wet weather. Obviously we have that wet weather today, but that comes again on Wednesday and then again it's going to be Friday in the overnight going into Saturday morning. Look at that rain and snow. We haven't had much snow in a while. As for today, it's St. Patrick's Day, so I hope everyone's wearing their green. But we are seeing some AM scattered showers today with a high of 58. Going down to 50 tomorrow. Monday is going to be breezy, but it is going to be dry. Similar conditions on Tuesday as well, but dropping into the mid 40s. And we're seeing those 40s throughout the rest of the week, but we do have some more chances for showers. AM chance on Wednesday and that Tuesday overnight, like I mentioned. And spring is going to start off wet and breezy with Thursday experiencing some breezy conditions as well. And then the next rain chance after that going to be on Saturday with some possible snow in the forecast. And if you want to stay up to date on when this rain and potential snow is going to hit your area, you can check it out on the 22 News mobile app.